Good evening, brothers and sisters in Christ. And also, good evening to all wonderful things who are here. And the message this evening is particular for you. So my dear young teens, in today's gospel, Jesus talks about some pretty dramatic signs. The sun going dark and the stars falling. Sounds like something you might see in your field, right? But here's the amazing thing. Jesus isn't trying to get, your, get our attention with special effects. He's sharing something real about living our best life right now, today. You know how it feels when your phone is buzzing with notifications? Everyone's posting their perfect moments and you are trying to keep up? Life in the real world can feel just as overwhelming. Tests coming up, family expectations, confirmation classes, trying to figure out who you are. But Jesus offers us something different, something more real than any future photo. Think about those rare moments when you put down your phone and really connect with someone. Maybe a deep conversation with a friend or actually laughing with your family at dinner instead of scrolling. That feeling of being truly present, that's how Jesus wants us to live our faith, fully alive, fully present. Sometimes the biggest challenges are in the, are in the big things. They're the everyday moments. Like when you are tempted to join in on the group chat worship, or when you see someone sitting alone at lunch, maybe you're choosing to help your mom with dinner instead of staying on your game. Jesus tells us that the best time to be kind, to be brave, to do what's right, is always right now. Every Sunday at Mass, it may feel like you're only here because your parents are bringing you. But here's the thing. Why we spend hours strolling through fields looking for something meaningful? Jesus is literally here in the Eucharist offering us something more real than anything we will find online. His actual presence, His unconditional love, His total acceptance of who you are. Think about your confirmation journey. Yes, sometimes the classes may feel like one more thing on your busy schedule, but they are preparing you for something far more important than gaining followers. They are about you choosing to follow Jesus, about finding your place in something bigger than any online community. These aren't just nice thoughts. They are about real life. It's about being as real in person as you are in your post. It's about sharing God's love as naturally as you share your favorite stories. You know how you can instantly connect with friends on your cell phone? The Eucharist 
is God's ultimate way of connecting with you. When you receive communion, you connect with the same Jesus who understands what it's like to be young, to feel pressured, to make tough choices. So here's my challenge to you today. Just as you might take a break from your phone to be present with your friends, try to be fully present for just a moment during Mass. Maybe during the consecration or when you receive communion. Instead of thinking about what you are missing online, focus on what you are gaining, a direct connection with God. Leaving your faith isn't about being perfect online or off. It's about being real with God and with others. Every message can be a reminder to pray. Every Mass is an opportunity to truly connect. Every moment, whether you are at school, at home, or on your phone, is an opportunity to show God's love. This is your time, not when you are older, not after confirmation, but right now. In the world of endless crawling, God is inviting you to stop and experience something real. Let's make it count, starting today. And dear my young friends, Remember, you don't need special filters to be beautiful in God's eyes. You don't have to earn favor to be loved by Him. And you never have to worry about being left out. Jesus is always there, ready to listen, especially here in the Eucharist. Let make every moment count, online and offline, by choosing to live with love right now.